I don't know, you know, it's hard to talk, it's hard to compare 2001 to anything, you know, it's hard to compare Kubrick to anything because of what it meant to so many people, that film. Uh, and we don't know what it's going to mean, this one, but we do know that, you know, when James Cameron says it's, you know, the best space movie he's ever seen, I think that's the ad you should run for the film, you know. I think, I think Alfonso made a really wonderful film. Well, we didn't have, I mean, the, the truth was, you know, we're in, you know, we're in these things for hours and hours on end, and you're, the main challenge is lack of, uh, of boredom, you know, because you really do just, it's uncomfortable, and you're, you know, you got to figure out ways not to complain, because, you know, I used to cut tobacco for a living, so complaining isn't really proper. Uh, but mostly it's just about uh, 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 sort of dealing with it being as uncomfortable as it was. It was a much more for Sandy, because she did it for so much longer than I did. Speaking of the boredom, you're a practical joker on set. Was there anything that happened in this film? Not really. You know, I, there was nothing, there was no time. You know, we were just, you know, they'd take you up and stick you into a, in, into a, you know, box and you'd screw you into these things where you can't move and then there was no chance to like, you know, tighten somebody's astronaut suit or anything fun like that. Explore, Dr. Stone's requesting faster transport to Bay Area. Explore, do you copy? Explore, permission to retrieve Dr. Stone. All right. Look, we need to get the hell out of here. The sci I mean, people sci-fi because it's not futuristic, it's current time, it uses science and, and the technology which sort of makes it fall into that category, but all that technology is used to make it more emotional. So I, I um, he used it in the most brilliant way to tell a, a really moving story. But all the challenges ended up being the thing that got me to where I needed to go because it had it been a very easy and cushy set and very accommodating, it wouldn't have felt as lonely and as, as, as difficult as it did while we were shooting, but you just use those things. It was actually the perfect setting to make this kind of story.